September 16th, 17th, and 18th, Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday, there is an announcement. Mercury is going backwards. It has been said by some people that know astrology that this month would be an economically dangerous time for the United States. If it was going to be so, this would be the beginning of it. Mercury going retrograde creates alterations. It's like things go slightly off. So you might notice that your computer goes off or your phone's not working or the airlines is late or you're suddenly not connecting. It's those kind of little bumps that make us have the opportunity to say, sorry, let me look again. So if the economy, if it's true what they say, they use astrology to predict all kinds of things. They can predict your health. They can predict the economy. It can predict when or not you're going to move, when you're going to change jobs. I don't tend to do that global astrology, but I'm fascinated by it. And let's just assume that Mercury going retrograde, if nothing else, is going to create some for the next three weeks, some kind of tension in the air. Your job, especially during a Virgo moon in Scorpio, is to calm down. Scorpio Virgo, this combination of earth and water, Virgo is earth grounded, Scorpio is deep and nonverbal. Both signs don't really like to talk. This is a chance for you to calm right down. And some of you are really good at this. In fact, you like not being around people and you prefer not to talk and others of you can't stop about nothing. This next couple of days, while Mercury's going backwards, take your time to review. Is there anything in your world that's got you a little nervous? Does anything need examining? Scorpio is all about calling your best friend and saying, I'm scared or I'm lonely. We tend to neglect that deeper realm because we're emotionally slightly retarded. If that's the wrong word, don't make me wrong. It's just truth. We are, as a species, a little bit off emotionally. We don't know how to share our fear. We don't know how to say I'm scared. We hardly know how to say I'm sorry. This is the next couple of days. Mercury's retrograde, the moon's in Scorpio. Take a little time to feel compassionate about your human self. And if things are getting a little rocky, why don't you be the change agent that allows there to be some calm and some quality feeling of safety at all as well? That's what I invite. All of my clients, I give them that feeling of, you know what? Nothing's as bad as you think it is when seen from the biggest picture. And that's why we go to astrologyanswers.com. That's why we go to astrology at all to ask, what is God thinking? What did she want from me? And how do I make sure that I provide a healing heart, an open hand, and a really genuine feeling that I care? If everyone asked that question, ask those questions, just think how kind this planet would be. A little bit intense, Scorpio, Virgo, and really kind. Brought to you by astrologyanswers.com. And just so you know, not only is Mercury backwards, but Saturn just went direct. For the first time since December, and for the first time for the next two and a half years, and it hasn't happened in 30 years, Saturn's in Sagittarius. And I'll be telling you more about that, but it's at zero degrees. It's just entered. So all you Sagittarians, sit up and watch the videos. I got news for you.